what is it the can we do as a citizen of this country when it comes to election? What, what, is, I mean, what are we supposed to do? My, my idea, and of course, I'm, I'm just Ahmed Jibril, is do nothing. Do nothing. Because why? Really, we don't do nothing. When we vote, all we're doing is uh, degrading ourselves. Why? Because first of all, our count is really doesn't going to make a difference. You know, even if it made a difference, you know, you know how politicians are. We've been in this country all this life. They promise, promise, and after they get in the position, all these promises go in the garbage. I mean, I've never heard anything good done. Maybe locally, yes. Yani, I've been following, and I've been following since Mayor Hubbard of this city. Yes, locally, we've seen some things, but that's not locally. We're talking about those big leaders who we never seen any good. We vote. And all we do is probably help them in their uh, aggression. And we are here. And we cannot uh, sit and watch and not be involved. We have to do something for us as a Muslim, a Muslim here, to be involved politically and uh, to have our way, you know, uh, heard. Well, uh, first of all, I, I don't believe it's Islamically right to vote. And we, let's assume you vote. Do you, did you f see any difference when you voted? No, that answers your question. Yani, even the scholars who they claim that said it's halal said if it's a lesser of the two evils. In this country, I congratulate all those who voted for Bush because your hands are as filthy as his hands. And killing your brothers in Iraq and Afghanistan. They said, oh, this guy is better than Clinton and better than, what's the uh, bomb? Al Gore. Al Gore. He's better than, he's, he's better, he's better than Al Gore. They said, he's better, he said, brothers, you got, Wallah, one time I heard this man talk. He said, he said, you guys, you don't know what an experience it is to go in the booth and to vote. It's just a few. Wallah, he was talking like that. Said, like it's something, subhanAllah, makes you feel so good. And we said, don't, who said, who said Al Gore is better than Bush? Who said Bush is better than Al Gore? Both are evil. In fact, the Muslim countries were better than Al Gore, in, in Al Gore and Bush's and Clinton's time, than they are today. Yeah, there was problems, but, but no, the Arabic leaders, all these stupid organizations we have, vote for him. All the Muslim organizations said, go and vote for Bush. Care. In MAC, and uh, uh, you know, the, the American, uh, the Arab Muslim over here, and oh, Bush. And worse than that, after he won, they bragged. We're the ones in Florida who got him to win this, with this election. We're the ones, I say, congratulations, you massacred a Muslim country. Congratulations, another country is going down, and after that one goes down, a third and a fourth country. Congratulate those filthy hands, you and his hands are the same. The way we do it is when we become real Muslims and we turn to Allah, then Allah is going to help us out. Unfortunately, we don't have that today. We extend our arms to everyone but to Allah. It's like someone who's drowning, and he hangs on to someone who's drowning. You hang on to someone who's drowning, or you hang on to Allah. We want someone who grasps onto Allah's rope.